apologize for this face again. Today requires us to not wear makeup and I'm pretty sure you're sick of this. Today's first impression review is going to be on the Ceramage Sermage Simarji <laughs> What else? Lifting Stick by Max Clinique. It's a unique lifting stick inspired by the Meridian lifting techniques. And I believe it's a Korean brand due to the fact that the packaging is in Korean. I saw this going viral on Facebook. Usually I find all my reviews from Facebook. And when they applied this to the ladies' eye bags, it magically appeared tighter. And there was just no more like wrinkly sagginess. Therefore, I decided to order it. And it took about two months. That's how crappy the shipping was for me. I don't remember where I got it from. Anyways, since it's a Korean brand, of course, you know I'm always on top of my game. No, no. <laughs> now, I know a lot of speculation and stuff is gonna occur due to the fact that Oh, hey, you don't have that much wrinkles. That's what you think? I tend to get a lot of wrinkles when I smile like this, right here. You may not think of nothing, but it's actually wrinkles. Also, you might notice that I have really big smile lines whenever I smile. Genetics. But, um, I have really bad smile lines. I feel like they're really deep and thick. Like, see? That's not cute. That's why I'm gonna come closer, and we're gonna review this. So, this is how the box looks like. Um, okay, that's just a box. Why are you gonna be like this? We're going good. So this is how it looks like out of the box. It has this very unique shape to it. It's shaped like eye patches that you usually buy for your under eyes. And when you take off the protective lid, it's just this white, creamy, it looks sticky. It kind of looks like white chocolate when you melt it and you kind of let it sit for a bit. That's my description on it. So here are the things that we're going to test on my face. Keep in mind, I'm only 22 and I don't have that much wrinkles, but girl, I do have wrinkles. Anyways, my main concern today is the fact that I have a lot of eye fat, as you can tell. Look, 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 oh, oh, girl, oh, girl. This causes my hooded eyelids like this. Therefore, I want to see if it's going to be able to lift up this fat, you know, this eye fat, you know. And also, when I smile... You can see right at the corners of my eyes that they are really wrinkly right here. And our next area of focus is around our, sorry I'm flicking you off girl, is our smile lines. This can go. Under the lighting change. For the heck of it, why don't we try this double chin? Maybe it might, you know, like straighten, you know, like tighten this and maybe give me a better, um, jawline. So in the video of the Asian lady, the tip of the stick or the point is going outwards like this and the side with the two bumps are facing your eye like this. So I'm gonna screw out some product using the bottom knob. I'll be right back. There we go. Is that better or what? So you want to do it so if it's your eyes like this and I'm just gonna swipe one. Mm. Oh shit. Oh my god, am I like seeing things? I'm gonna go right on my eye now. <laughs> Relax, guys. Oh my god, what's going my eye? I thought I could lay my eye. So we're just gonna keep doing this and we're gonna bring it up towards our temple as you guys can see. What the heck is this? I wanna really try to see if there's gonna be a difference from the eye fat or not. Okay guys, I don't think it matters anymore because if you flip it to the other side, the point's gonna be in here in order for this to fit your eye sack. I'm just gonna flip it around a little. Up and down. Try not to get this in your eyes. I mean, I don't think it will do much, but like blind you. My eye bags actually look clearer, like right here. Do you see how it just like tightened this area? So there's no sagginess right there. It lifted a bit on the corners of my eyes. I don't know if it's me or it looks less fatty. It's definitely still there. It does look less noticeable though, I must say. I feel like my smile lines are the most noticeable, so maybe this will work. I'm just gonna... Oh lord, please don't irritate my acne. I'm just gonna put the point in and just... This is cute. Again, the corners and drag. <laughs> okay, I think it's just me, but I'm feeling fabulous right now. Time for our jaw. I 
I really hope this is not gonna like cause more sagness after because you know like we're kind of like stretching and pulling our skin in. I will toss you in the trash. My face actually looks and feels so much smaller. Is it just me? So my final thoughts on this. Sorry the lighting keeps changing because of the I feel like it did work on my jaw. I don't know if I'm exaggerating or if my brain had somewhat convinced me to believe that my jaw has become sharper and smaller in a way, but it feels like that and I'm gonna go with it. And for my smile lines, I think it worked better on this side of my face. This side, not so much. For my eyes, no, I don't really think it helped my um, eye fat up here. I mean, I felt like it worked a little bit, like it tightened it up. All in all, my eye bags feel very firm. It did not work on the eye fat, but it did work on my eye bags. This stick is amazing. That is it for my first impression review. Please give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And don't worry, my GOT7 Part 2 rant will be coming out soon.